Hello guys, in this video we are going to be taking a look at the Sunpack Portable Vlogging Kit. Uh, we're going to start off with just the box and looking at everything it says that it offers. So it says that you can use it anywhere and we see that it includes a 6 inch bicolor LED ring light which is the one that's shown up there. And then uh, of course it's a smartphone mount and it's got a 42 inch tripod with ball head. So these actually extend to 42 inches, which is pretty cool. And it's like a little disclaimer. Smartphone shown is not included, of course, for illustration only. Simulated screen images on the side here. Portable vlogging kit slapped on there. And I'm not going to read through this whole thing, but I'm going to look at the highlights. So it's got a 6-inch diameter uh, LED ring light and, of course, the 42-inch legs that it shows which is very nice and you can read through all of that if you want to if you want to pause the video then on the other side same thing and top nothing there and then bottom so we are going to go ahead and open this up from the top here and i'm gonna to have to put my phone down to do this so we have the box that is empty right there and we have the contents we have the contents here, big plastic thing protecting it there, little instruction manual, and a surprisingly heavy tripod mount. This is actually good, I would say, because I guess higher quality, which is always good. And we get the little control here, camera 360 iOS, and then there's also an option for Android. Not sure how this works, but after looking at the manual, I will be able to understand this better. And there's also an off on switch right here. And it looks like it already comes preloaded with batteries, so that's cool. And it's got like a little keychain slot. And let's actually look at the back here. CR2032 lithium battery next up in that small baggie we get the holder here where you're actually going to put your phone and yeah and here's the little where the screw will go in and yeah pretty nice okay and in the bubble wrap we get the light ring and it looks like it'll light up from only this side right here and it's got a cable and it's got a usb plug here to power it uh, type a and we see all the functions there okay here we have a mapping of the remote i was looking at so of course the power button and then brightness down and color temperature switch that's what that is a single button for that and brightness up which is indicated with the plus sign and we see all the other items here as well the color temperatures range from 3200, 4500, and 5600 Kelvin. And it shows it fully built in the back and all the features and specifications. We have a description of the parts and assembling your portable vlogging kit. And it's basically the instructions to assemble it, which is really nice. And powering on and using the unit. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and assemble this, and I will be back once it is built. Okay, so I have this fully extended, and this is as wide as the legs will go as well, so you can get a good shot of how big that gets. And I've attached everything here, and yeah, it looks pretty good. And I actually went ahead and plugged it in so you could see it plugged in there to a USB port and this will be lit and I'm gonna actually show something else here oh the knob you can control so there's like this sphere thing right here and you can control if you want that really loose or really tight so right now it's like moderate and if I go I believe clockwise it'll it'll be a lot tighter so it'll be a little tougher to move more resistance of course you can swivel this around and however you would like and also there's another position for this mount uh, I will be using it like this but you can also screw it on through the back like that if you want to do that 
Yeah, so this tripod is mostly made of plastic and these textured things right here, it's like, they're like the heaviest part. I'm not really sure what this is, but it's got like a, like a rubber coating and I guess it's like all metal inside on these textured pieces. And these are, I would say, aluminum. And I noticed they have like the little ball bearings here. Okay, and these legs are kind of finicky. Sometimes these ball points will go in, sometimes they won't on their own. Uh, if they don't go in on their own, you'll just have to press it down with your finger and go down with it, and it should go down. Okay, so let's go ahead and actually turn this on. So let's pay attention here to the remote. So I believe it said you had to hold the power button down. And let's see. Oh, okay. So I just pressed it, and it gives off that beautiful lighting. And yeah, you can see how bright that is, and you can change the intensity of the brightness. So let's, um, oh, I just changed the temperature of the lighting. So those are all the temperatures. Brightness up and brightness down. Pretty nice. So this is going to be kind of intense. I'm going to be looking at it as I go up. And yeah, we see that. That is really bright. Another cool thing is that you can actually lock these legs. So if you actually, uh, when you hear the clicking sound, these will be locked. So there's the clicking sound and it shouldn't go in and it will if you go with enough force. And if you move it out of place, let me try to do that real quick. Move it out of place and you can put it back in easily. And just wanted to show that. Also, this thing has a lot of imperfections. As you can see here, the word is completely just smeared. And it looks like this is going to be coming off. <clears throat> also, you see a lot of these little plastic bits as well. And I am just pointing these things out just to point them out. And there's another little bit right there. And yeah, that is expected. Another one right here too. All right, so now I'm going to go to Bluetooth and I'm going to connect the remote. So I'm actually going to switch this to landscape and we're going to go over to Bluetooth and we go down here and you actually have to turn the device on and let me actually turn it off and back on because I've kept it on for a while. But yeah, you will see it appear right there and then you just press on it and Bluetooth pairing request. Press pair, and it is paired, and we should be good to go. Okay, so here we have the product in full effect, as I would like to call it. And yeah, we have the light on right here, and then we have the camera. And I'm going to actually switch it to video mode to show you how this works. So this is already uh, paired with the Bluetooth, as you saw me do. And since I have an iPhone, I'm going to press the one that says iOS. So... Okay, so if we press the button, uh, it'll actually play the video. And I'm not sure if you can see it too well there, but yeah, it, it played the video. And if I want to pause it, or I mean, if you want to end the video, you press it again, like so. And you probably saw the square turn into a circle, which indicates that the video is over. And we're going to flip over to the photo mode. And this one, you'll be able to see a little more clearly. So if I press the button right here, it'll take a photo and press it again, another photo. Yeah, and you pretty much get what's going on here. And that's pretty cool. And yeah, apparently this works for Android as well. So that is cool. I want to see if these other modes work as well. So let's go to portrait and yeah, portrait works. Pan, not really sure how that's going to work, but and yeah i'm not going to be dragging the phone but it's doable and yeah portrait we did that photo did the video slow-mo slow-mo does it as well and finally time lapse and it does time lapse that's pretty cool yeah i think this is a really neat feature that i'm going to be using now that I'm here, I do want to mention that this actually has the clear case from the Apple Store and it has the pop socket, so you can see how far it can actually reach your phone, even with the pop socket and a very thin clear case.
All right, guys, and that'll pretty much do it for this product. In the description below, you will find my Twitter and Instagram linked, and you will also find a SoundCloud link down there, as well as a Spotify playlist, which is a compilation of some of my favorite songs of all time compiled into one playlist. So, yes, and I will see you guys in the next video.